I'm just kidding. Um, it's Desi, baby. Does anyone can see this? Hmm. My ball fell off. Mm -hmm. And it's too early to go to another one yet. The place is not open until like 11 or 12. It's like 7 in the morning, I think. So, yeah. So, this is a response video. It's one of Komari or, um, Luka Tomboy's video. Um, I didn't really want to make a, um, response video anytime soon. Since I'm new to YouTube or whatever. But, um, seeing it, I just want to put my input in. The video is called for my homeboy, my homegirl. And the homegirl part, I kind of had the same kind of dilemma. So, I just want to put my input right quick. Um, the homegirl thing was, she said she's a lesbian. And she wants to know, um... She's a virgin, and she wants to know, should she let her stud girlfriend take her virginity, or should she let a real man do it, a real man? And, um, I used to think the same thing, wondering, like, no, I don't know. And, um, Luke was saying, you know, are you really gay, or how old are you, are you confused? And I definitely agree with that, because at the point in time where I was thinking about the dilemma, I think I was a little confused. Um... I was young, ready to lose my virginity. I'm not sure if I am yet. But, um, basically, to um, the young lady who wanted to have that answer, I know what you're dealing with. And first off, if you're even ready, you know, make sure you're ready. Um, because you can't get it back. Never. You never can get it back. Um, are you in love with your stud girlfriend? Um, you wanna just got sex with a random guy? Yeah. Um another thing was um why I think you may be feeling that way. It's kinda of if you use it to a strap. It's really plastic and you're probably wondering, does it even still count? <laughs> a lot of people kinda of think that it doesn't count because it's a strap or whatever. So I don't know, it's kinda of my input mixed up, jungled up, um, didn't come out how I wanted it at all, <laughs> but basically the point was, think about it, you know, um, if you're not ready, then you're gonna lose it, like, hold on to it, you know what I'm saying, I'm not saying hold on to marriage or whatever, but what's you ready, and um, yeah, you know, how old are you, are you even sure, are you, are you gay, you know, or are you, you buy it and you really love this girl, but you're kind of wanting that now, you know. But that's it. Um, okay, um, before I go to the homeboy, I say I'm sorry for making this a mirror video. I hate, I don't hate people who do them, but it's really distracting for some reason. The only reason I did it is the light where I usually do my videos. Like, it sucks, like, it really sucks. So I just decided, hey, I'm just doing it in here. I don't sleep, so no one's bother me. But, um, for the homeboy, who's a stud, and it's having a problem, she's in high school now, she's having a problem, her mom thinking, you know, she's just my girly, and it's understandable for her mom to want the little girl just girly, you know what I mean? But at the same time, everyone deserves to have their own uniqueness and their own individuality. And whether you're gay or straight, if you want to dress like, you know, tomboyish or boyish, that should be your decision, you know what I mean, and, um, you deserve to dress how you want, because either you put it, people are going to label you, and some people live by your style, you know what I mean, if you're going around dressing like a girl, you're not even comfortable, meaning you're not rocking your shit how you should, you're not, if you're not comfortable, you're not, so, I think what you should do is sit down and talk to your mom, tell her, listen, this is just who I am, this is what makes me comfortable. And Liverpool said maybe you should compromise, and I definitely agree with that, because, um, you don't want to just blow off your mom, like, no, fuck that, I'm doing what I want, like, no. But, um, definitely, you have to, you have to do you, you know what I mean? Because at the end of the day, you're being judged what you wear, you're, you have to wear these clothes. Your mom is not wearing these clothes, she's not working on your skin, you know what I mean? So, you see, I just... I think she'll sit down with your mom in your high school, so 
and a little kid, you know, you pick up your own clothes, you can decide, you know, you should be able to decide what you want to wear, and I think you're old enough to have a conversation with your mother, you know, um, old enough to know how to kind of deal with that, and I disrespect her in a way, like, look, I'm gonna do what the fuck I want, like, no, don't do that, please don't, I don't say Dusty said do it either, <laughs> um, I definitely think you should have to sit down, talk to mom. You know, just let her know how you feel. So this is just what makes me comfortable. I mean, the clothes. I'm pretty sure just like a boy is comfortable. Um, yeah. So both of you, wish you good luck. To the girl, um, I said, I, I've had that dilemma. And the thing was, I wasn't too sure like I knew I was I like girls and I was attracted to guys but now I'm realizing it since I've been in a relationship with boys and it never went far you know what I mean it's because that's all it was a physical eye attraction I never could be in a relationship with a guy I can never have sex with a guy like it's just how it is that's just me so I know I'm a lesbian and don't let someone force you you know wait till you're ready wait it's just something you want to do and you're sure you want to lose it too. Be in love with that person so you don't regret it. I'm not saying just because you're in love you're not going to regret it. Just try to do everything that will make you not regret it. Because it's something you can never get back. Um, I wish you two guys the best. Look, like, I love all your videos. Oh my god. You're so cute and I love the way you say Really? <laughs> I can't do it but. Um, yeah, I love you. I'm definitely stay tuned. Um, everyone, please check out my videos. Yeah, I'm sending out. Uh, <laughs> uh, only I can get away with something like this. Uh.